260 down the back straight. Damn. Really fast. And, uh, and, and you know, about 200 through that corner down the back straight. 200 through corner. Can you imagine? And that's why now I know why I had to put on all of this neck support because in this kind of car, you get thrown away around way more than you would do in, say, like a Ferrari or a Porsche around the track. So, props to you there. You did awesome. Good luck. I've never seen this in a race car yeah, before. So this Can you is explain? a brake bias. So we change the, you know, where the, uh, how much front brake we've got or how much rear, depending on uh, whether it's straight line braking or sort of, you know, with steering angle on the front rear. If we stiffen up the front, usually it creates a bit less front grip. Okay. Or, uh, you know. You so don't have to muck around with these too much though. We change them a lot you do? through the race, okay. depending on your uh, your tyre quality. Yep. And your balance. So, um, and then obviously your six speed sequential shifter there. Straight back. <laughs> that was really cool. Wow! Wow! <laughs> that was amazing! It's very loud. Um, it's a completely different experience to all the other tracks. I usually I go around the track in you know, a Ferrari or a Porsche, a um, McLaren. These guys, they're not afraid of just taking on those curves. You know, the curves will come up off the side of the racetrack. They just go straight up and over the over the top of them. So you like this the whole time trying to get trying to get like stabilized in the chair. And no wonder these chairs are so tight, so narrow, because you otherwise you'd be flying 
going all over the car. Like there's a lot of rocking going on in there. All right, I've got the driver here with me now, Lee. Uh, this is my 13th full-time season, so I've been racing since I was seven years old, did go-karts and uh, went through all the ranks and then, yeah, been in this series for 13 years, so... So why V8s? Why not anything? Uh, V8s is the top level of motorsport in Australia, so um, you know, it's the only place where you can sort of make a career of it in Australia. And apart from that, if you want to go somewhere else, you obviously look to open wheelers, um, which you need to be overseas pretty early for that, you know, when you're in your teens. And, and have a massive budget behind you. So I didn't have that, so yeah. this was always my aim. And the engines, what are we talking about here? We get our, our engines off Kenny Mack that do triple eights engines as well. Um, he, they, they basically do about five or six engines in the field, and that, so it's a five litre block. Um, it, it pumps out about 670 horsepower, so they get absolutely everything out of it. Revs to 7,500. It's a lot of grunt for, um, for under the foot. So, yeah, it, that's what makes our, our category so cool. I love it. Thank you so, so much for taking me around. No worries. I'm glad thrill. you enjoyed it. It was a real thrill. I think you took me around an extra time. I did. I thought I'd give her another laugh. I'm here with Charlie. I've just calmed down now after about 10 minutes of being out of this car. That experience is like nothing else. You're actually the team owner. I am. I know. I put all this together and it's what an experience. There's nothing like you can do it anywhere in the world. What do you love about it most? Because there are lots of different, you know, racing sports. You know, lots of different categories of cars on the racetrack, etc. Why this one? This is the closest category in the world. There's nothing close to that. In qualifying is within a second. So it's really, really close racing. It's door to door, door handle to door handle, yep. a lot of rubbing, and, and it's so close. So anyone can sort of win. Awesome. Thank you Terrific. so much. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank All right, there you go, guys. I've been here with Seacrome. Seacrome's actually giving away a car. Crazy. They're actually building their own car. Uh, it's going to be a V12. So that's why I'm really here in Melbourne. Sipchrome actually sponsored this team, Team 18, that I was just going around the track in. Came down here to, to kind of get the word out that they're giving a, a car away and got to have this incredible experience while I was here. So, what does Sipchrome do? Oh, I'll show you. Look, tools, tools, mate, tools. Tools. Tools, mate. A lot of these tools. Alright, you're gonna fix a car. You use them on a daily basis, huh? Yeah, I use these all the time, um, fixing and doing up my own cars. Lucy might get a bit scared if I attack her with this. Lucy! <laughs> I hope you liked the video. That was just a really last minute thing. I thought, oh my god, I'm getting into a, a V8 supercar here in Melbourne. Let me share this experience with you. I hope you enjoy that. Please like the video, subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you on the next one. Love ya.